Well, there are a lot of things in Berkshire that the why now is answered by, can be answered by the fact, well, we just got around to it. The, uh, uh, the huge chunk of capital in the insurance companies is at national indemnity. Uh, so we have moved uh, through these quota share arrangements. We've, we've moved premium volume that gen is generated at Geico or MedPro or different companies. We've moved that up to the parent, because that's where all the, there's a, you know, there's just extra layer after extra layer after extra layer of capital there. And that it makes it a little simpler that way. It makes it a little simpler just in, in, in keeping all the money invested and in, in, as opposed to having 50 pockets or 75 pockets to look at it, if, if you have a couple of main pockets to look at it. There's no, there's no real change in the, in the uh, certainty of payment of policies or anything of the sort. It, just, it really makes life a little, just a little easier in terms of managing the money by having most of the, most of the funds concentrated in, in national indemnity. Um, uh, so there's no mastermind to it. We ended up with a few companies uh, in Geico Corp, which was a holding company for Geico uh, itself, and it just seemed that we probably ought to get those up to the parent company level, and, and we put them there. But our general approach is just to keep every place loaded with more capital than anybody could possibly conceive of us needing, and that's going to result more and more probably in the funds being concentrated in national indemnity. The U.S. is not a